Alright, the fated day has arrived. I'm playing my most hated character in this game. Um, but if you don't know, even though I hate this character, and even though he may look brain dead, he is actually very hard to play. Um, however, the reward for playing him is absolutely insane, alright? So, um, yeah, let's just keep that in mind. So, first of all, I do want to say if any Happy Cast players watch this video, please tell me what I'm doing wrong. You know, it always helps. Um, but uh, after this video is uploaded, I'm still going to be playing him. Um, I will say this footage is old. This footage will be a few days old by the time you see it. Um, and I did that in order to give me time to evolve for tomorrow's video. I might make another Happy Chaos video uh, just to show my evolution. And uh, I don't know how much better I'll be, but I promise you I, it will be better than this, right? Uh, no offense to the guy I'm fighting, but luckily he's not amazing at the game. So it allowed me to be bad with Happy Chaos. Um, so uh, here... I don't know what you're supposed to do in that situation. I think that this was the best thing I could have done, I think. Um, I should have put my gun away there, I'm pretty sure. That, that would have been the right move. Um, and, you know... If you know how Happy Chaos works, you understand why I'm making these mistakes, okay? So I don't really have to explain them. Instead, I want to talk about um, my history with this character. Um, I believe that was the correct combo right there. I just messed it up and I did like a shorter version than what it should have been. Um, but anyway, my history with this character is he came out, right? Uh, he came out last year. Whoa! Wait, did he come out in... He didn't come out last year, did he? No! Wow! Whoa! Whoa! He came out in 2021. Wow. Jesus. I'm thinking he came out in November. Yeah, he came out in November of 2021, not 2022. Oh my god. Wow. Wow. I've been doing this for that long. Um, anyways, I made videos on him. Um, and I'm not I'm not afraid to admit this, right? I, I can admit when I'm wrong. I'm not afraid to admit this at all. I was actively calling him the worst character in the game. Straight up. I was... Uh, I'm not even a, a, afraid to admit it. Um... Yeah, I was actively calling him the worst character in the game. Why is that? Because, number one, um, he doesn't... If you don't know how he works, uh, every character in this game has light, medium, heavy, kick. Right? Light, medium, heavy, kick, and dust. Those are the buttons. He literally does not have a heavy attack, right? His heavy attack is instead replaced with this gun. So the unique thing about him is that when he presses the heavy attack button, he pulls out a gun, right? And it doesn't matter what he's doing. I, I want to clarify this. It does not matter what he's doing. It can be anything. Um, as long as he presses the heavy attack button, he will pull out the gun, and you can shoot while he's doing it. It does. It can be during his six. P it can be any animation that he has at all. Um, he can pull out the gun during it and shoot you. Um, it's very, very, very hard to get used to. I can't lie. <clears throat> it's very hard. But that's why he's broken. Because no matter what move he does, it can be the most negative move on the planet. He can just shoot you during it and make it safe. Um, but here's where the hard part comes in. <coughs> you see that meter at the bottom? Number one, that little bar... Uh, if that bar goes, if, if I don't have that bar, I can't pull out my gun at all, okay? So pretty much that means if I don't have that bar, I literally don't have a heavy button at all. I'm playing a three-button fighting game. Um, if he does have that bar, though, he can shoot. And also, he needs bullets to shoot, obviously, and that's what that meter is. And you have to reload. I don't know why he stopped playing there, by the way. I literally, I, maybe he thought he died? I don't know. Um... But yeah, you need bullets to shoot also, obviously. Um, here is my problem, right? And this is definitely why I thought he was a bad character. Because, I was, by the way, I shouldn't have shot three there. I should have shot two and then let my meter come back. Um, I thought he was a bad character because I was playing him like you would play soul bad guy, right? I was getting in your face and I was just going ham right 
And unfortunately, when I did that, I would end up spending all of his resources. And then when he has, like, like this situation right here, uh, if, if Geo wasn't one shot, I would literally be in the worst possible situation you can be in. Because I have no meter, no ammo. Um, and now I do have meter, but I don't have any ammo. So I still can't do anything because I don't have bullets. Um, and do I lose this round? I may actually lose this round. I don't know. But, um, yeah, once he runs out of ammo, it's over. But here's the thing, right? You may be wondering, yeah, maybe he is hard, right? Um, it, it, he has all this stuff. Like, what what can possibly be... Like, he seems really hard to manage. And he is hard to manage, right? But here's the thing. If you don't play this game, you don't understand. He can break the wall from literally anything he does. Um... And it, it can be full screen, pretty much. And he will break the wall. Um, and it's brain dead easy to do it. You just shoot them with the gun. You walk over. You do, like, a little combo. Um, not a very hard one. And then you break the wall. Uh, if you break it with a super, it refills all your, your resources. Or you could just manually reload. Like, it, it's not hard. I should also say that when I, when he can shoot you during his moves, right? He literally has a move where he just rolls behind you. So he can roll behind you and shoot you in the back. But it's near unreactable. Um, yeah, he is broken, right? It's just that you have to get used to playing this game with only three buttons. And your fourth button is like... It, 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 your fourth button isn't a button. It's literally a mechanic, pretty much. Um, see, see right there? I rolled behind him and shot him. The problem is that I shot too many bullets. I have to stop doing that. I have to shoot maybe one bullet, maybe two, maybe two bullets. Um, but honestly, I don't think I should have done that because then I gave up the, the, the corner advantage. And I think it ends up costing me the game, spoiler alert, but... Um, no, it doesn't. Uh, but yeah, he's crazy. Um, and definitely one thing that I have to get used to is that if you jump with this guy, his jumping kick sucks booty cheeks. It's absolutely garbage. Um, it doesn't, like, if you jump and you do kick and they are standing on the ground, it just won't hit them. Um, and I keep struggling with that because I use kick a lot um, because I just feel like it's a very good button. It's fast, you know. Uh, if it hits them out of something, it'll combo. Like, it, yeah, but not with him. It just sucks. I have to stop doing that. Um, and my other go-to when I don't press kick in the air is heavy. He doesn't have a heavy, so I have to get used to jumping to jumping with a slash. Um, right there, I should have killed, uh, but I didn't. Yeah, it, it's a tragedy. Um, and if you also don't know the history of this character, he has probably he's arguably ruined the competitive scene for this game. Um, he is literally all you see in tournaments, he, yeah, he's just, he's everywhere, um, and he's broken, and I, I think they, I think they tried to nerf him, I think, but it's, it's so hard to nerf a character, because even if you nerf his zoning, he'll always have those crazy safe buttons, and the, the ability to break the wall, uh, you, you, don't, you don't even have to look at the game, and he'll just break the wall. Um, obviously, I'm telling you this, and I'm getting beat up here, but that's because you have to press a lot of buttons, and you have to press them fast with this character, and you have to press them in the right order, okay? Um, yeah. Uh, he He's not harder than Zato. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to say he's not harder than Zato, but for me, he is because you literally have to get used to the fact that, number one, you're controlling two hands at once, pretty much, right? Um, and you always have that other hand ready. Uh, and I have to use that more. But I also have to use the fact that, or I have to pay attention to the fact that when I do eventually use that hand, that will use my resources, and it will literally cost me the game if I run out of resources at the wrong time. Um... Yeah, it's it's a lot to take in, um, but you know he he is a degenerate character. Like right there, I should have broke the wall, but I did far slash. And I, I honestly I don't know why far slash came out. I guess she was too high up. Um, uh, right there, instead of shooting, I should have reloaded and then did six uh, S. Um, but it's just it, it's a lot to take in with this character. And some of it is easier said than done. Um, 
but I will give them credit, okay? I will give Arxis credit. As much as you hate this character, you know, he definitely has an execution uh, barrier here. But it is definitely worth your time, right? He is not some it's not a waste of time, you know. You if you put the time into this character, you get you get uh you get some stuff out of it, right? You get some you get some bang for your buck by putting in work with this guy. Um, instead of grabbing there, I, I, may, I probably could have punished with a uh, combo, but I just grabbed. And also, I'm doing close slash into 6S a lot. I, that's not the combo you're supposed to do, I don't think. You're supposed to do... I believe you're supposed to do close slash uh, 6K. Uh, shoot, roll, close slash 6S. Shoot, I think. Um, uh, but I, I literally forgot that combo existed until after I recorded this, but I, I used to do that combo when he came out. It's not like I didn't know about it. Um, but yeah. And, and yes, normally, uh, when I, when I upload a video, I like to take the moments that are the most interesting. I take the matches that are close. Whether I win the, win or lose the match, I take the best matches, right, and I upload them. Obviously, I'm not doing that here. I'm just uploading everything because I don't want to... I want to show you the process, right? Um, because I do have to give this character credit, right? Even though I do talk trash about him, he is very difficult compared to the normal character in this game. You know, compared to other games, maybe he's not that difficult. Um, but, yeah, he, you have to put in work here. And I completely sold that, by the way. There's no reason I should have lost that game, and I did. Um, but yeah, he, 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 he has a gap that not a lot of characters have in this game. He has a, a, a learning curve. Um, most characters in this game is mash, close, slash, mash, heavy, slash. You get a combo off of it. Congratulations. Um, or you, you do a 2H or something. Like, not, like, it's not, most characters in this game aren't rocket science, but, uh, you know, he, I, I've, I've, I've had a harder time learning him than I did Zato, right? I can play Zato pretty okay, not amazing, but I can play Zato, um, and I can definitely have better results than what you're seeing in this video. <sighs> yeah, unfortunately, the raw Ram Super. Um, I haven't seen tier lists on the new, uh season of this game, I do wonder where they place Ram. I don't know if Ram is still at the top, and I don't know if Happy Chaos is better than Ram. I don't know how people feel about that. Either way, it's a... It's a thing. Again, did the wrong combo. I know what I'm supposed to do now there. Just... Yeah. But, but what... I, I definitely didn't utilize 6S at all when I started playing this character. Like, it's such an ignorant button. I should have done it more. But I didn't. But I don't know why. Oh, Jesus. Okay. Um, I believe this is the final match of the video. Um, a little bit of a chip player. He's going a little ham. He's going a little sicko mode on me. But if I you know, could just shoot him in the forehead, it'll be over. Um, also, one thing that really annoys me is that he just doesn't put his gun away. Um, I really, really hate that. So if you know if you know if you play the, this character, you understand he has a move where he aims and he shoots. Uh, and when you cancel that move, he keeps holding his gun out. Like I no, I I want him to put his gun away. I feel like that's new. I don't think he did that before. But no, he keeps holding his gun out. So when you cancel, I think the move's called at the ready. I think when you cancel that, he's still holding his gun out. He's just holding the little the not, the not as crazy version of the gun out. Like what are you doing? Like put it away. It's so annoying. And then when you use his super and it doesn't break the wall, he also keeps holding his gun out. And it's like, put the gun away. What are you doing? Um, so, like, right here I have to mash uh, the, the button to put the gun away so he doesn't hold it out when, I, when the super's over. It's just... If he put his gun away automatically, he'd be so much easier. Um, but obviously that's where the execution part comes in. Um, combined with reloading and putting the orb down and, and getting his concentration meter up. Yeah. It, it's crazy. Um, anyways, you know, like, subscribe. I'll have more stuff tomorrow. I'm thinking tomorrow is going to be another Happy Chaos video. Um, 
but yeah, uh, uh, peace. Slash.